Hello, my name is Dr. Alduan Tarr, positive psychologist, parenting and relationship expert, here with another tip on how to empower your son to be the strongest man possible. I've been a psychologist for 10 years and I still remember one of my first three cases. It was a young lady, actually a grandmother, that came in and gave me the audacious task of making sure that her grandson went to college. Now what made this such a, a challenging task was that everyone else in the family had gone to jail. No one had even graduated from high school. Well, she took every recommendation that I gave her. She enrolled the young man in 100 Black Men of America so he could have a mentor. She spent the money on tutorial services during the school year. She spent the money on summer school so that his grades could boost up so he could work his way out of summer school. And she also made sure that she worked extra hours so that he could dress for success. She took all those recommendations, and because of it, this young man was able to go to college on a full scholarship just last year. However, there was one recommendation that she could not follow, which resulted in him actually dropping out of school one year later, and now he's homeless looking for employment. The one recommendation she would not take was to allow him to make mistakes on his own and to struggle. As a grandmother, she just could not find it in her nature to allow her son to, to grandson to struggle. She felt guilty because the mom and the dad were incarcerated, but in reality, it had nothing to do with his ability to struggle and to persevere. What happened was when he went to college, he learned that he had to work and he had to earn everything instead of things being given, given to him. Grandma wasn't there to talk to the teachers. Grandma wasn't there to get him out of trouble when he was, you know, mouthing off to, uh, to peers. Grandma wasn't there to tell him to study. He completely failed because for the first time, he was forced to be a man. So moms, grandmas, don't make that mistake. Allow your son to struggle. Allow him to work starting at 14, 15, 16, of course 17 and 18, to understand just how hard it is to earn a dollar. Allow him to struggle to figure out how to do it on his own and then be empowered. That's how he's going to lead a family, that's how he's going to lead a company, and that's how he's going to be able to lead himself when he goes to college. So don't make that fatal mistake. Alright? So I will see all of you July 31st, 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. at the Downtown Decatur Holiday Inn. I'm going to give away these tips as well as many, many, many more. And remember the three bonuses. I'm going to give you all your sons in free, doesn't matter how many you have. And then two, I'm going to give them a free mentoring session plus a free relationship seminar for you moms because you deserve it. I'll see you there. My name is Dr. Tart, empowering your boys to be strong men. Take care. Register today.